Kyle Loader is an Emmy-nominated and award-winning actor and singer. He was accepted into the School of Visual and Performing Arts at Syracuse University, and began their intensive BFA drama program. In early 2000 during his sophomore year in college, however, Destiny called when an invitation to attend a showcase in Los Angeles eventually relocated him to the West Coast. Kyle signed with representation shortly after his arrival in Los Angeles and was immediately hired for modeling campaigns such as Abercrombie and & Fitch, and Speedo. In July of 2000, five months after his relocation from New York, Kyle landed a three-year contract role with the NBC daytime drama, Days of Our Lives, 1965, a role that would later bring him an Emmy nomination in 2003. It was during this time that Kyle was hired to play himself on the legendary show, Friends, 1994. As himself, Kyle played a friend and Days of Our Lives, castmate of Matt LeBlanc's Joey Tribbiani. After a six-year run on Days of Our Lives, Kyle jumped networks to sign a four-year deal with The Bold and the Beautiful, 1987, on CBS. Still equally passionate for his music, Kyle's vocal talents were soon written into storylines on the show, and it didn't take long before Kyle began to officially lay the foundation to expand his career, musically. The Bold and the Beautiful, currently holds the Guinness World Record, as the most-watched daily drama in the world, with over 50 million viewers daily in over 100 countries worldwide. This level of exposure provided Kyle with the resources necessary to record, release and subsequently promote his debut self-titled album. The international popularity garnered from both shows over the past decade has taken Kyle all over the world to perform, from Australia to Monte Carlo, France to Italy, even north to Scandinavia. Having just wrapped up a year of playing, Stacy Jacks, in the Las Vegas company of Broadway's Rock of Ages, Kyle headed east to take on the title role in Joseph and the Amazing Technicolor Dreamcoat, in Philadelphia, before finally returning home to New York.